your step for me. My name is Sarah Whitmer. I am a deckhand at Kenai Fjords Tours, and this is my second season. And I am recovering and coping with a traumatic brain injury. I was about 40 miles from home when I hit black ice. And then I woke up 12 days later in the hospital to not have like two weeks of your life. It's definitely, ugh, where to begin? Being out in nature lifts me back up. Say, there's one just behind us. Yes. Yeah, so this is my actual car. When the guardrail ended, that's when my car flipped three times. This is when, when I was in a coma and laying in bed for two weeks. I said I was about five millimeters away from being a quadriplegic or dead. And that's a picture of me learning to walk again. So I had little grippy socks to help me out. Being home in my parents' house, stuck in one place, not being able to drive, really solidified that desire to like listen to the ocean, which is a pleasant sound instead of my heart monitor beeping. <laughs> when we turn off the boat or when we're at the Chiswell Islands watching whales or seeing puffins. A sense of awe is definitely what Alaska inspires. There's a day in the hospital I didn't think that walking again was gonna be possible, let alone working on a boat. What a deckhand does. We're like 20 things rolled into one. People ask me all the time on the boat, like, do you get tired of seeing this? Do you take it for granted? Like, I don't. I slept all night on a big white ship. Seagulls were dancing all around. I'm at peace when I'm in the ocean and at the glacier. It's just that time where I can just reflect. Even when you have a crazy accident, you can always figure out a way to do what you want. 